Hi guys, it's Constance, and I'm doing a mini, um, I just got finished with a mini album that I did for a friend, and, uh, his name is Weston, and so I did his name on the front in, uh, gold stickles, and then, um, I used the boys' paper pack to be able to do the cover and all the pages on the inside. Um, he's got a lot of fibers here, including the little star that you saw on the front that goes in a chain. And then if you open it, it's got a clasp like this, and that opens backwards. So when you open it, it's got to be pulled through. So it has to be put down in there to close. And I tried to flip this around so you could just put it in there and lock it, and it wouldn't stay locked right. So, so when you open it up, the, you get... The page here that's got some journaling that she can write whatever she wants to him on it. And it says, A treasure to a little boy does not consist of money, gems, or jewelry. He will find far greater pleasure in the wonders of rock, pebbles, sticks, or bugs. And then um, on the side, there are two tags here. Get it back in there. And I always tilt my tags to the side. That way, uh, the closures can always go completely closed. This is not easy to do with one hand. I love my flip camera, but I hate how I have to video with it. And I can't find another one right now, so. Okay. So, then she's got two large tags on the side. And then you open it up, and there are two photo mats here that go in this pocket, and then a photo mat there. There's a pool photo mat here, another one of those photo mats, a large photo mat, and another one of those photo mats, all in one pocket. Then she's got journaling for the photos, and then two more photo mats. You go into the pocket, and there are two large photo mats, and then there are two photo mats here that go into this pocket. Some journaling for the photos. Journaling on those side for the photos that are here. There's a pocket. This is four tags that go in these two little pockets right here. Okay, so there's this pocket. Just two tags. And then the pocket has journaling on the back. There's a plain photo mat, so it's gonna go photo mat and a pocket. And then there's another pocket just like it with the two tags and the journaling and another photo mat. So they're going to go just like that. Then you open it up. That section, you've got the two large photo mat tags with journaling. Open this. Two large photo mats on each side with that really, really cute paper behind it. So the pocket has two large photo mats and some journaling on each side. And in this page, you have these two photo mats in the back a photo mat and journaling pull tab, and then an actual one that will pull out with some journaling. Then you've got journaling for the tags that are in this pocket here. Two large journaling spots, another journaling tag and photo mat. Journaling, journaling, photo mat, and a large tag which she can put whatever she wants on, pictures, anything. And then just like the other two I've done, we have the Halloween tags with large photo mats. And then journaling. Oh, it's stuck. I just had to glue this back down. Well, I have to make a new tag now. But two journaling, two photo mats. Oh, see, that one's sealed first. The other one I didn't get glued down all the way. Two large uh, photo mats with the journaling spots. And then they have the Christmas tags with large photo mats and journaling on the back. And then two large journaling spots with some large photo mats and the two more. And that is it, guys. Thank you very much, and I hope you enjoyed it. Um, it's just a simple pull tag album. Um, I like those because it gives you a lot of interaction and a lot of photo space. I think there's like 110 pictures that will fit in this album. And it is just for a little boy so I didn't want to make it too bad and you see how thin it gets with half the tags sticking out and then it's like this with all the tags in so 
Um, but uh, if you have any questions about anything I did in the album, please feel free to ask. Thank you. <laughs>